Hi everyone, I'm Elizabeth Uclas. My name is Josue Damian Martinez. And we are resident assistants in Jacques de Jarier Hall. Welcome. All right. Tap it, yeah. Good. Sorry about that. That's fine. Uh, welcome to Jacques de Jarier Hall. We're gonna give you a tour of what the hall looks like. Um, if you have any questions, concerns, any comments, feel free to put them on the comment section and someone will answer all of your questions. So, you ready? Yeah, let's go. Follow me. All right. So what we have here is our lobby to the main entrance. Uh, you can see some couches here. People like to just sort of hang out, coming about. Uh, We've seen meetings happen down here, just hang out and do homework. There's very comfortable couches, and then outside we have a small courtyard where people also like to just sit down and chill. In the front here, we also have some tables, and we have a wonderful piano where people just come and sit and play some wonderful music. I can't play piano, but um, if you decide to live here, you definitely can try that. Sounds good? Cool. We're gonna go ahead and, and give you a little tour of the room and just the hallways down here. Alright, so every hall in the residence halls has a theme, and so as you can see our theme here in Desjardins is Pixar, so this hall's theme is The Incredibles. So the RAs put a lot of work in every year to make decorations for the hall, and then every resident gets their own door decoration that has their name on it so they know exactly where their room is at. And now we're going to visit a room actually. This room is a suite. Um, this is not going to be the same room for every single room, um, but the inside of the single room is what pretty much every room in Dejari looks like. But this is a suite, and there are also doubles. I like the door slam. All right. So now we're going to check out a room. So this is what a room in Jacques de Jarry Hall looks like. As you can see, the girls here put a lot of attention into making the room look great. Every room comes with a desk and a desk chair, and it also comes with a drawer to keep your clothes in. And then every room also comes with a bed that can be lifted or raised. Um, and uh, so the rooms don't have a microwave or a refrigerator uh, that comes with the room. But you can purchase one, um, and I highly recommend purchasing one. It kind of just makes things easier. But if you don't want to, we do have a kitchen that has a stove, an oven, uh, a microwave, and a refrigerator as well. So um, there's a lot of cool things that you can get to decorate your room. I highly recommend getting a refrigerator and a microwave, but you can also get really cool decorations for your walls. Um, you can go get a twin extra long sheets for your beds and then get some cool decorations for your desks and for, you, you can get a rug and everything. And so every room also has a sink on the inside. So in this specific room, because it's a suite, the bathroom is right out here, but in a normal room in Jacques de Jarier Hall, you will have the sink and you will have another door that leads to your bathroom. So here's one of the sinks. And then every room also has a closet. This is just how these girls here decided to decorate their closets. They decided to keep all of their clothes in one, and they used their other closet space as kind of like a pantry. So yes, um, every room will have a little uh, pole to hold your clothes on and a, and a space to put more stuff on top if you would like. But yeah, this is what every room has. Um, and then in every residence hall, there is a resident assistant like Josue and I. So we are there to do programming, to do community builders, whether it's movie night or whether it's um, game night or anything like that. But we also have bigger programs, more educational programs that follow a, a, a learning objective. Um, so that's another really cool thing that we do here. We're actually going to be having a program tomorrow called um, Jack Wire Jamboree. So we're very excited about that. But yeah. It's kind of hot in here, Elizabeth. Do you think you can control the temperature in here? So you can only adjust the temperature about two or three degrees above and below. And if you need to get a bigger temperature switch, you can re send a maintenance request in. But otherwise, um, we ca you cannot control the AC beyond those few degrees. Perfect. But yeah.
And then every resident will have a key and a mail key to their room. So if you're in a suite like this, you're going to have a key for that front door, and you're also going to have a key for your main room door. But otherwise, you'll just have your room key and your mail key. Yeah? Should we do uh, look at the restroom? Or? Yeah, of course. So this is not going to be the size of every single restroom because it is a, a suite. The bathrooms are a bit bigger. But as you would suspect, it has a toilet and it has a shower. Um, most of the showers will come with a curtain for the shower, but these girls decided to go ahead and get their own shower curtain, which is totally fine. Just make sure that you keep the old one um, when you move out at the end of the year. But you can get a mat, you can get uh, toilet paper, you have hooks here for the towels, and then, yeah. So this is what a bathroom looks like. Um, again, the size is not going to be the same in every room. This is just what a bathroom looks like in a suite. Yeah? Great. And so every door also has um, a lock for this door right here. So you can lock it here, and then it also has a deadbolt. So you can spare it very securely um, secure your room uh, when the, you will not be able to use the key, not be able to get in unless you have a key. So yeah. So Elizabeth, is this floor in particular a living learning community or is it just a normal community? Yeah, actually. So the, the, the first three floors of Dr. Jerry Hall are for the Honors LLC. St. Edward's University has a variety of LLCs and uh, Jajari is home to the Honors LLC. So that is this floor and the two above us. Great. Yeah. Right. So every floor also has a common space of some sort. Residents just can come in here and they can get their work done or watch TV, hang out, play video games, any kind of thing that they want to do. So we have one of these on every floor. A lot of times you'll see residents coming in and eating dinner together, or the resident assistant will have some of their community bills over here, whether it's a movie night or a game night, or anything that they want to do when they're hanging out with each other. And then um, Dejari also will have a second study room that attaches to the first one, but it's only going to be uh, on the first and second floor, and then the third and fourth floor study rooms also attach, and it's the same thing on the other side. But yes, so this is the east side of Dejari, and the east side only has four floors, whereas the west side has two floors. And then in Dejari, we have two laundry rooms. We can show you one really quick right here. We have a soda machine and a snack machine as well. And luckily for us at St. Edwards, we have free laundry which is not a luxury that you get at other universities, so it's pretty awesome. So just plain and simple, you just throw your clothes in and you put a timer on them. This is what a, one of the washers look like. You just toss your clothes in and you put in the setting that you like, and then you put a timer and just come back. And then the same thing with one of the dryers. Pretty simple stuff. You don't get uh, free laundry at a lot of universities, so we're very grateful to be able to have that. But yeah, living on campus is a really great thing. It's really nice to be able to have all of these things at your disposal very close by. Um, I know that I really enjoyed being able to be in Dejari, being in the middle of campus. You're really close to Joe's and uh, the dining halls and a lot of main uh, buildings on campus too. All right, now we're gonna go back out and show you some more of our common spaces. So if you look right ahead here, this is where students have their mailboxes. And so you come down to the front desk uh, the day of check-in and you get all your keys, everything that you need for the year. And you have your mailboxes here. There's usually a slip or something. If you have any letters in particular, you can come get them here. Um, here we have our wonderful desk workers. And they are in charge of just basically anything that the student needs uh, to mail, to equipment rental, um, essentially any of your questions that you have around the, the hall or you want to check something out. Um, you can come downstairs, but um, we'll go ahead and follow me.
We also have a printer here that you can connect to. Uh, sign says here you cannot print more than 15 pages, but it is very convenient if you're upstairs in your room. Uh, the printer will usually work, and so you can just print out anything and, and come and get it down here. So actually, some of our RAs are actually playing ping pong right now, but this is our common space. As you can see, it's pretty big. So we usually have a lot of students hanging out, watching movies. It often happens on the weekends when people are just sitting down, they order food and whatnot. It's kind of like a really good place to socialize. We also have a lot of our programs that take place here. Um, we have a kitchen that's right over here. Actually, we'll go ahead and show you. And any equipment that you need for cooking, you can definitely check out at the front desk. Uh, it's also another plus to this uh, residence hall. And we have some storage units here. Make sure that when you bring your own food and you have stuff, you have to put your name on it. If you don't put your name on it, don't know what to tell you. They disappear. So we have a refrigerator here as well. Um, where people can store their food. Um, again, make sure you put your name on stuff. Freezer up here. Basic refrigerator. Sink. Someone should have cleaned these dishes, but they didn't clean them, so make sure that you clean your dishes right after you uh, use them. Uh, we have more storage places here. Cabinets, as you can see. Um, stove. Oven. Dishwasher, not sure. Um, I've never used it before, but maybe you might better use it than I am. Microwave, and we have a vending machine as well. All right, great. Take a look at the rest of the common space here. Like I said, our RAs are playing ping pong, so maybe they might say hi to you, maybe they will. <laughs> Hello. Hi. Hi. And any of this equipment can be rented from the front desk, as I mentioned earlier. So if you want to come downstairs and you feel like having a little game with your friends, anything that uh, has to do with the pool table as well, uh, it can and is available to students. It's available to all of you. So we're going to go ahead and check out the printing room right now. So in Dejari Hall, we do also have a computer lab. It's very convenient. Um, we have Mac computers here. And again, you're able to use all of the software that St. Edwards University provides. We have all the Adobe software that you can use right here in your home in Dejarier. We have a whiteboard that you can use if you ever need to get any work done, need to put some problems on the board and work with your friends. We have our long tables right here. It makes it really a really great space to study and hang out. But, you know, it's also a great place to get your work done. And like Josue mentioned before, this is uh, one location that you can come to print any documents that you might need. And you can also use the IP address on the printer to connect your laptop to it as well. But yeah, this is just another one of our spaces that we have. We're going to come back out to the game room. And always remember that whenever you're in Dejari or any residence hall at St. Edwards University, you do need to use your key card to get in and out of the building. So you, we have our exits right here, and then we also have the entrance that we came in from by the lobby, and there's also another back entrance over there in the lobby as well. So just always make sure that you have your St. Edwards University ID on you. But yeah, we love living here. It's great. We love interacting with our residents. Living on campus has a lot of great benefits. Being at St. Edwards in general is just great. We are on South Congress Avenue, but we're away on our little hill. So it's really calm and peaceful. It's a good getaway from, you know, a really crazy day. You come back to Desjardins and you feel like you're home. But if you ever want to go, go to do any fun activities, if you want to go do outdoor activities, there's a lot of really cool uh, activities to do downtown. You just head right on Congress and you head all the way down. You will run into South Congress. Um, SoCo that has a lot of really great shops and everything and if you go even further you get to downtown uh, where there's a lot of really great things to do but at the end of the day you come here to your home on the hilltop and Jari is one of the best places to come to um, but yeah of course uh, you want to exit this way so that we can just show the yeah. little fountain and then we can end the video here's another courtyard that connects us to the other two residence hall Basil Moreau Hall and Casa Hall but again, this is another part I really like about Dejarier. There are a lot of trees and a lot of just like nature elements around. It makes it feel really homey. Um, and it's another one of my favorite reasons that I like to come uh, and, and I like to live here. It's like come home and I see all of this nature and it makes me feel like I'm at home. Awesome, yeah. this is great.
Well, that concludes our tour. Elizabeth and I want to thank you for being with us and you can rewatch the video. Any questions, comments, concerns, again, put them on the comment section and uh, your, answers, your questions will be answered. So thank you so Thanks much. Thanks so much. We hope to see you on the hilltop. Bye.